Hi. Airships Conquer the Skies is a game all about designing, building, and destroying airships, ground ships, and non-ship ships across the world to willingly recruit the entire population into your cult of the Fimboy. And if that sounded unhinged to you, good. Let's start with that first one, designing your flying war crime. And that flying part seems important, so let's begin there. Now, I'm not a fucking nerd, so I have honestly no idea what the lore is or why there's these giant fuck physic rocks everywhere, but I'm sure there's a good reason. This is Suspendium. I know. Whoever came up with that is also probably responsible for naming the mental illness known for causing difficulty to grasp English FUCKING DYSLEXIA, BUT I DIGRESS! You really have two options here. You can either grind up a crystal like your least favorite child, Timmy, and shove it into a balloon. I'm sure that'll end well. Or just putting it in a room and praying to your chosen deity that it doesn't explode. It doesn't work. It never works. But remember, if you pick the room idea, then you have to make sure that you have enough coal to keep the room running, because apparently you need to sacrifice bits of coal to your chosen deity. I pick Zeus. Speaking of, there are a number of resources to make sure your engine, gun, and hentai of choice keep running. And these are coal, ammo, water, and humans. For that last one, I just pick Colt at the start of the game, and then it doesn't matter how many I lose, because there's always ten more willingly ready to sacrifice themselves to the Fimboy altar. As for the other three, just make sure you have a healthy amount of all of them, and research fire extinguishers as fast as possible. You'll thank me later. You also need command stuff around, just make sure you can give your craft orders, we'll talk about that in a minute. Now, on to killing. My favorite part. Your tools for murder are anything from basic rifles, cannons, flamethrowers, men, triplanes, biplanes, whatever these are, big cannons, bigger cannons, really fucking big cannons, hentai, shitty rockets, bigger shitty rockets, torpedoes, acids, and grenades. All of these are viable. Except for grenades. Seriously, who the fuck uses grenades? But this all begs the question. Why? While there are technically other things to do in airships, really the only thing you're gonna end up doing is the conquest mode. Come on, come on guys, it's it's in the name of the fucking game. In this game mode, you'll have at least two other factions dropped into a randomized world, everyone starts with one city and two towns. Your cities can build your airships and ground ships, as well as contribute more money to your empire, but towns are typically lightly defended and can be captured easily. And this is also where you can research important science, like murder, murder, and murder. Your first few steps on this journey will be to design and build the, your first craft, and start to conquer your neighbors. And don't worry if your ships at the start of the game are shitty and lack safety features. All that matters is that they're cheap, and you have a lot of them. In battle, you're gonna have to give your craft orders, otherwise you're just gonna sit there and be as useful as a politician. <laughs> Our world is dying. All the orders can be seen down here, and it looks like there's a lot, but honestly, I only use about four of these. The important ones are move, for moving, ram, for, yeah, board, this allows marines to uh, board other people's ships. Uh, then over here, you have normal fire, which all of your guns will, you know, fire at a steady rate and aim fire, which makes them shoot a lot more accurately, but at a much lower rate. There's also rapid fire, but I don't use that very much. 
Your success in this game is going to greatly depend on your ability to use the airships you have in the most efficient way. Wow, that sounded really fucking nerdy. Uh, yeah, let me put it in a simpler way. Just play the game. After a certain point, you'll understand how things work, and you'll understand why nobody uses grenades. Big tip, put your torpedoes and craft that are in the back of your line on aim fire. You'll thank me later. So, airships is fun. It's enjoyable, and it does what it does very well. Here pretty soon there's a major update coming out which should overhaul the diplomatic aspect of the game and add a co-op conquest mode. Normally it goes for about 25 bucks on Steam, but as of the making of this video it is currently on sale for about 18 bucks, so if you have some money to throw around, go pick it up. It's worth it. And if you don't pick it up, fuck you. <laughs>